So some people will say, why do you still want to um, admit him to Achimota school? Obviously, from what is happening, if he gets in, it, it, psychologically, it won't be healthy for him. Yes, um, 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 we have looked into it. Um, but the point is, um, other schools that I have approached, which um, I, don't, I wouldn't want to mention them, but um, I realize that they are equally reluctant. I don't know if it's because of the media hype or if it's because of um, um, the fact that GES gave the directive and the, the school didn't go by it and, and, and um, we had a meeting and GES finally you know, re re relented on their words and, and backed Achibota school against us. I am thinking maybe the other schools um, are looking at that you know, not to accept him. So if if not for that, we would, we would probably would have enrolled him somewhere, you but know. Uh, you had um, other schools as well approach you, apart from the ones that you have gone to. Any positive outcome from these schools? Um, so um, I have to take this opportunity to clear this. Um, it's a facade. It's not true. Um, it was in the news by one of the media houses that the children had scholarships and the children had been approached by other schools, you know, and it's not true. There's no school that have approached us except for um, some universities abroad that, you know, contacted us, but then it is for university, you know. So um, anything... Private schools, no private school, international schools, because we had five international private schools had uh, gotten in touch with you guys and all that. No, it was rather, you know, from abroad and and it's not um, like I, I'm saying it's not for the secondary school it's for the university so um, the news going around about you know schools approach that and all of that is is not true